guys it's Marguerite here and today I'm making this very cool I'm really excited to make this because I love how this look came out and it's just this very nice Valentine's Day look because Valentine's Day coming up and I'm so excited to spend it with my boyfriend and um, I'm more excited because this is kind of like my first like really Valentine's Day where I'm actually spending it with someone special so I hope you all are excited for Valentine's Day. I honestly can't wait. And doing this tutorial, like this makeup look, made me so excited um, <laughs> to do this look for you guys. Because I really hope you guys, for those of you who aren't too found with makeup or don't really know how to put makeup together, or those of you who are just like me and you know about makeup but you just love watching other people's videos, I decided to do this look for you guys. And don't mind my hair because I just got out the shower. Um, so I just did this look real quick. And I'm just like kind of in sweatpants today I don't know if you can see sweatpants but I just wanted to do this look for you guys so anyways let me get started this is just a nice neutral look um you have some pink and brown into it some glitter some light pink hot pink and then um a very neutral face and it's really neutral um and then just a nice lipstick so I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I don't want to make it too long because it's kind of complicated of how I got this look just because I really wanted to show you every single step I did when I was doing it on this eye um, I wanted to show you in this video so I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I hope you guys keep watching um, I hope you guys subscribe to me it would mean so much to me if you just subscribe and just let me know you subscribed and I definitely and I promise I will take a look at your channel and um, I will subscribe if I like your videos and if I don't I will just I'll still check in on your videos so anyways guys let me get started with this video Alright, so first what I'm going to be doing is taking this palette that I got from Payless. Um, I think, oh, no, I got this from Target, I'm sorry. It came with, I don't know, but I'm taking these two pinks. And I'm just going to be using these as kind of like a setting, maybe like a base for my um, pink eyeshadow. I'm going to be using the Sonia Dekashic eyeshadow brush. And I'm just going to get it onto the brush like this. And then apply it to my eye. Kind of just apply it um, until I until I get a nice pink color, like a light pink. All right, all right. So that's fine. So I'm all set with that. And then next, taking my um, Elf palette here. So then I'm going to be taking this. Where did it go? Hot pink color, right there. And this is where things might get a little complicated. So you're just gonna want to stay with me because we're gonna be using this. Um, hot pink color a lot as well as this light pink color a lot um, so what I'm gonna be doing is just taking this eyeshadow brush from renewal and as you can see I already have my hot pink on it from the other eye and it just looks like this and I'm going to be taking this pink and just applying it to the outer half of my lid so just a crease gonna look like that it's just gonna have it it should look it's gonna look a lot deeper after all right my focus is messing up again guys just a minute all right and then taking the same brush I started with which is the Sonia Dekashic brush I'm going to be going into this very nice light pink color and just applying that into the other half of my lid so after we do that we are going to be taking a white I'm going to be using this white eyeliner pencil and I'm going to color in the crease and bring it down just a little I mean the crease I'm sorry the tear duct and bring it down just a little to give my eye a pop of color taking this very light gray you can see right here above the white kind of going into the neutral color 
I'm going to be applying that onto my brow bone. Taking my Urban Decay eyeshadow brush and taking the color Sin from my Naked palette, I'm going to just apply that into um, my tear duct and right about halfway in, just like that. And, oops, alright, so just like that. And then again, I'm going to be taking the color um, Dark House, I believe, is it Dark House? Yep. So we're going to be taking the color Dark House right there. And then with this pencil brush from e.l.f., it's actually called the e.l.f. Contour Brush. Alright, it's not focusing, I give up. Anyways, I'm just going to take that and apply that above the hot pink, so really into my crease. Onto my brow bone. And then taking my Sonia Dekashic Blending Brush, I'm going to dab it into that color again. And just in windshield movements, I'm just going to apply it up kind of right until we get under the, um, eye, the eyebrow. Alright, so it's just going to look like that. And then what I sometimes do is I'll take a clean brush and just kind of go over it a little just to kind of get any of the excess off. So I just took a clean brush and I kind of just went over it. So that's what it's looking like for now. And then this is really confusing. Going into this hot pink, I'm just going to take it, the hot pink we started with, nothing different. And then I'm just going to apply it into the crease. So over the brown. And then with the pencil brush, I'm just going to take the pink and just apply it to the same spot that we started it with. So it kind of just looks like that. And it may look a little harsh, but it actually isn't. Um, I think it's just the lighting that I have. So anyways, what I'm going to be doing now is taking this pencil, this white pencil, as you know, that we started with. And I'm going to apply it under my eyebrow and this is just going to kind of um base my highlight color so it looks really harsh right now and I kind of look like a clown I know and then taking this white color again from my elf palette I'm going to apply that and then I'm just going to blend it down So it's just going to look like that. Alrighty. So now we're getting into the more simpler part. And the part that I really like the most because it kind of completes the look. I'm going to curl my lashes. And I'm going to attempt to put on this liner in the mirror. But this liner is really hard to use. It's the H2O waterproof liner from Wet n Wild. So I'm going to try my best, guys. I'm going to try my best to do this. And you're going to, it's going to be a thick line, and you're going to wing it up kind of into the crease a little, and it's really going to give you a nice flirty look. All right, guys, so we are halfway through um, with this. And what we're doing is from this Claire's Glitter Palette, I'm going to be taking this color gray right down here. I'm going to be applying it with a, I'm just going to be taking some with an angled eyeliner brush. And because it's kind of like, sorry, it's kind of like liquid liner, I'm just going to dab it right into the wing. Like that. And then again into the tear duct. 
so it just looks like that. And it really gives you a pop of color, but this one doesn't have as much. There. It really gives you a pop of color. You're all done with your eyes, so it really wasn't that hard. And then I already, for my um, cheeks, because we have pink going on, I just applied this Mega Glow from um, Wet n Wild, and it's really hard. It just looks like this, and it's just this nice, here, I'll put it on my arm. And when you rub it in, it just kind of gives you a nice glow. So I just applied that right there because we don't want too much going on. And then for your lips, I'm going to just be applying this really, it looks hot pink, um, but it's in the color 52D from Wet n Wild. And it's just kind of like this, um, just this pink color. But I'm going to be applying just a little to my lips. Well, first let me try to make sure they're dry. Alright, not dry, but... look so um you're not going to apply any lip gloss or anything because you don't want it to look too crazy um so that's the look i really hope you guys enjoy and if you guys have mine don't mind my hair it's kind of like i just got off the shower and decided to do this so i really should have just like um clipped it up better but yeah that's just the look so i hope you guys enjoy all right I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and if you guys have kind of like a Valentine's Day look, just post it as a video response because I would love to watch it, and just let me know how you think. Please subscribe because it will mean a lot, and that's it. I hope you guys all have a great Valentine's Day, and remember to stay glamorous and be fierce. Bye, guys.